Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to download and use ChatGPT desktop app. But before we start, hurry up and check out our data software just under this video. So let's get started. This key is how do we download and, and use ChatGPT on our desktop app. So just to give you some information here, there is no app that you could actually install on your Windows PC. So you can only use this on your web browser. So in this case, uh, if you really want to install it in your PC, well, in this case, we could actually use uh, a, an app here to install it because we only or the app for ChatGPT is only available in mobile, but we could use an emulator to basically simulate a uh, Android device and install it on our PC. PC. Again, so in this case, the first thing you want to do is you want to actually go to the official website for the following uh, app, which is going to be bluestacks.com. Now, from their website, you should be able to see a download button. You can go ahead and click on it, and once you've downloaded that, go ahead and run the.exe file like you see on my screen here. So, once you run the.exe file, go ahead and just follow the on screen steps to complete the installation. So if you want to get a full tutorial on how to install BlueSacks in your PC, we actually have a tutorial for that on our channel. So make sure to check out our channel for the tut full tutorial. But once you've installed the BlueSacks into your PC, this is what's going to look like. Now, from here, you want to go to System Apps and you want to open up Play Store. Now, the first thing that you'll notice is it's going to ask you to log in. So this is the first time that you're accessing it. So it means go ahead and just log into your Google account. But once once logged in, you can go to the search and apps and game section. Just type in ChatGPT, and you should be able to see ChatGPT at the right side here. So go ahead and click on install. And from here, it's going to start the installation process, and you just need to wait for a few seconds or a few minutes for the process to complete. But once it's actually installed, you should be able to access it by clicking on the open button that you see here, or by basically going to your home screen and double clicking on ChatGPT. Now, this will open ChatGPT here, which in this case, you can go ahead and continue with your Google account or sign up with your email. So, as an example, I'm going to click on continue with Google. And from here, you should be able to start signing in. Let's go and click on continue here. And from here, we should be able to choose our Google account. So let's just wait for it to load up. Now, once you've chosen your Google account, this is what's going to look like. So it's going to start logging you in. And that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.